Hey everybody, this is Mount to Do Soldier playing Resident Evil 2. Um, on the previous video, I made it to the police station. I got the special key <coughs> from a uh, excuse me or something that stuck in my throat. Uh, from Brad Vickers. Uh, yeah, we'll go through this door. That's the only one that's unlocked. Hang in there. Are you the only officer left in the building? Uh, who are you? Claire. Claire Redfield. I'm looking for my brother Chris. We lost <laughs> contact with him over ten days ago. Chris. Jill Barry. Every last Stars team member has disappeared. We should have listened to them. What happened? About two months ago, there was this incident involving these zombie-like creatures in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other star's members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything at the risk of their own lives. But no one believed them. Are you okay? Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But... Just go. Okay. Just hang in there. I'll be back soon. And he has locked the door behind us. Now we have the key card. We can use the computer. Okay, we will start, excuse me, um, we'll start on this side. Ooh, I'm getting tired. I woke up at quarter after six this morning. I tried to take a nap this afternoon, but <clears throat> couldn't go to sleep. I'm going to put the knife away. Hold on to the special key. And, yeah, there's a file here. Um... I don't know about grabbing it. Yeah, might as well. Police memorandum. <clears throat> this letter is just to inform everyone about the recent movement of equipment that has happened during the precinct's rearrangement. The safe. I'll just get to the main part of it. Two, two, three, six. Yeah. That is for a safe in uh, uh, on the other side of the police station. Okay, in here is a first aid spray, but no, I'm not going to bother getting any first aid sprays. Uh, I think if you use a first aid spray, your rank is going to lower, but I'm not going to worry about my rank on this playthrough. I mean, technically, I mean, I'm still going to try to go for an A. Yeah, the head is missing. Seems to, seems to have been twisted off. Okay, gets more bullets. Much needed bullets. Okay, yeah, some blood is dripping from the ceiling. Wonder what that is. Yeah, yeah, just... I'll, I'll come back to him. It's better to, you know, avoid him now instead of going after him. <laughs> you know, I mean, I, I usually... I, I can usually kill it it's, you know, on my first run here, but... Nah. I'm just gonna go through here. Uh, We'll come to that room later. Yep, 
There are some zombies here, and I'm going to stick to this end. There are three zombies. Oh, yeah. Actually, I think there are four of them here. Oh, I don't. Oh, I don't want to run out of ammo. Oh, that would be that would be really bad. Oh, no. Okay, I'm still on good condition. Good condition. Okay. Now I get to use the herb. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to. Yeah, this is really bad. <laughs> really, really bad. Woo! Got him. Okay, there goes one. I still have. Eh, I got some green herbs here. Hold on to a couple of them. Um, throughout this game, probably even the previous game, I have a habit of getting more, uh, gathering more healing items than I need. But don't worry, I'm not going to go through a lot of it. I'm going to hold on to one. And I'll put the other one in here. I'll uh, find some red herbs. I'll mix them up with those. And yeah, okay. Here's the locker to use the special key on. Okay, there's an outfit that should fit you. Uh, I don't know. I I'm, I don't think I'll put on. Well, actually, I'll just change just to show what the outfit looks like. I'm not really going to, you know constantly wear it in this playthrough. There's an old gun here. Yeah, I'm going to get this gun right here. Okay, six bullets. Yeah, look. This is Claire's outfit. Now, this one is kind of special. Let's see. Colt SAA, artillery model, used by cowboys in the Wild West, designed for a quick draw. This has a higher uh, firing rate. And Claire's pose, yeah. It's like that. Okay, I'm going to change back to my original clothes okay uh okay good I didn't really reload that one uh okay I'm gonna switch to this yeah I think oh yeah there's a f file here but uh yeah I'm not gonna bother collecting uh files in here. I mean, I, I collected some on my playthrough for Resident Evil Director's Cuts, but I'm not going to do that for this one. Just the important notes like the 2236. Okay. Uh, there are only five bullets in that one. Yeah. Okay. We can move on, and I'm thinking about yeah, yeah, yeah. Might as well kill these zombies here. Yeah, this has a higher and fi higher fire rate. Great. Oh, there we go. There's one. And yeah, that's it. And I got nine bullets left. Jeez. Uh, there are... Yeah, there are a couple of ammo uh, statues. Actually, there's a hidden one up here. Okay. Yeah, here's a puzzle right here. We, we encounter our very first puzzle for the game. Okay. Uh, there's a red jewel up here. Something is written on the mountain. The god of sun and the god of moon, their gaze upon me is the only thing that can release red soul. Yeah, there's some ammo behind the statue. Okay. Uh, we just need to push the statues over to those sides with the, uh, with the squares. 
That way these statues will be uh, facing the statue. I mean, the Joel Red Soul Holder. Yeah, call that. Uh, let's see. Okay, why isn't it making a noise? Okay, there's one. Okay, we get the red jewel. But if you examine it, it's actually a virgin heart. Okay. Okay, now here's the star's office. And oh my. <laughs> Yeah, that, that was a little dark. I was, I'm looking at my laptop at the same time that uh, door was loading. And wow, that is really dark. If it's a little dark, I apologize. Uh, I don't know. Uh, yeah. <sighs> okay. Get the handgun bullets. I think there's another... Uh, oh, no, that was it. Okay. Yeah, this is a key file right here. Chris's diary. And talk to the chief today once again. Refuse to listen. Uh, of course, the entire mansion went up in that explosion. Along with any incriminating evidence. Uh, let's see. See a lot of little reports. With the help of Jill and Barry, I finally obtained information vital to this case. Okay. Uh, flying to the main Umbrella headquarters in Europe. I won't tell my sister about this trip because doing so could put her in danger. Please forgive me, Claire. We have the Unicorn Medal. Uh, and here we get the grenade launcher and I'm thinking about using that on the liquor yeah explosive uh, explosive rounds or actually no explosive you know, grenade rounds yeah those can be very helpful against the liquors so yeah I'm going to use it on that one liquor that's down on the first floor We get some mail here. Uh, Federal Police Department Internal Investigation Reports. That was mailed to Chris. And it's about the G virus. Mr. Irons has allegedly received a large sum of funds and bribes from Umbrella over the past five years. He was involved in the cover up of the mansion lab case along with several other incidents, incidents in which Umbrella appears to have direct involvement. He was arrested under suspicion of rape on two separate accounts during his years as a university student. Underwent psychiatric evaluation. Extreme caution is advised when dealing with him. Jack Hamilton Section Chief, Internal Investigations, United States Federal Police Department. Yeah, that was mailed to Chris. Okay, now we're going to head on out. And, wow, this... Yeah, I apologize if that's really dark <laughs> with the doors loading. Or maybe that's just me looking at my laptop. But, yeah, it is a little dark. I remember back in the day, well, 
at the time I was using my uh, smartphone to record videos for uh, Doom and Doom 2. And they're, the videos, oh my gosh, they were like way too bright. Or way too dark. It was like, wow. I should do a redo for uh, Doom 2 eventually. I did one for uh, Ultimate Doom, but I didn't add commentary to it. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna switch to the grenade launcher. I know it's a few doors down, but it's best to have it with me. Get ready for a scare! Yeah. Okay, here. I can hear him, but where is he? I want to draw him out. Oh, yeah, there he is! Ah! No, you're not going to get me, boy. Ah! Like a shot. Alright, yeah. Yeah, might as well mix these up. I never really, uh... Eh, nah, I'll just put in the item box along the way. Yeah, I don't really use, uh... More than one green herb when it comes to orange caution. Well, yellow caution, that is, but... I don't know, you know, I, I just mix up two herbs. And, you know, use that. But for boss fights, oh yeah. Yeah, make sure to use them. Okay, let's see, I'm about 17 minutes into this video. Yeah, I'll stop the video when I get the uh, first key for the police station. Okay, uh... Yeah. Okay, let's see what key we got. Precinct key. We'll examine it. It's a spade key. Okay, so on the next video, I am going to use that key. So, Okay, this is Mountain Dew Soldier signing off, and I'll see you next time.